I've been blessed to get to sing with people that have inspired me um, so much. And it's it's sort of surreal to get to, I mean, these are like your heroes. These are these people are the reason that you're here. You know? She loved to like joke and stuff backstage. You know, you would think that, you know, she's this ethereal, like beautiful on the outside and inside. You would think that she would be sort of proper and like, sort of like you think of Julie Andrews or something, but she really had like a wonderful sense of humor. She was body. She was like, so funny and always ready to like joke around and like have a good time. And I remember being surprised by that because I saw her like she was on a, such a pedestal to me. Right. But it did not take long to just feel like we were just hanging out, palling around, you know, backstage like old buddies. <laughs> we had some jokes, some like Whitney Houston joke or something where we would do like riffs backstage on this legit music. And but I do remember us like just laughing and having fun backstage. To think that, you know, 20 five years before that I was listening to her on a you know CD of <laughs> the secret garden and like trying to sound like her and then flash forward to getting to perform with her on Broadway and then get to perform like duets and group numbers and things with her in these concerts it's just I, I never I'm still like such a theater nerd at heart that I just I never get used to <laughs> I never get used to it it's just inside you're a little bit like nervous and a little bit like excited you know you're all of things because you know she's one of the main reasons that I'm here she's one of my main inspirations after she passed away and there was like the articles and all these things and all the posts that I saw in social media and everyone that knew her talked about what an amazing person she was and how lovely and nice she was and that was like the first thing that everyone talked about like every single person and I was just like it just goes to show that even though she had one of the greatest talents that mm -hmm. anyone has ever been blessed with, that the main thing that people that knew her took away was her heart and what an amazing person she was. The most important thing to be is to be someone that people want to be around wow. <laughs> and to be someone that's willing to help and encourage those around you. You know, people want environments where they feel like a peer and where they feel like their contribution is important and where they feel like they're being heard and supported and she was just the epitome of that and um you know if we could all try to follow that example and um make it more about the we than the i <laughs> she always always did always <laughs> then the world would be such a better place so i think the lesson is be like rebecca <laughs>